Ladies and gentlemen, the horses are on the track and prating postward, race number two. This the first division for three of the Philly Trotters in the fourth leg of Ohio Sire Stakes action. Racing one mile, a purse of $15,000. Feel of seven, there are no changes. Nine minutes until post time. The one is a daughter of Carry the Message, shown by Ken Appleman of Hebron, Ohio. Bill Long Jr., the uh, trainer, with a three year record of 203 and one, earnings of $16,000. Bill Long Jr. driving Carry the Lady. The two is a ditto Hanover filly owned by McCurgan and Carter. Don McCurgan trains with a two year old buff, 202 and three, earnings of $53,000. Don McCurgan driving. Lizzie Brown. The three is an overcomer filly, owned by Max Graber of Pemberville and Raymond Creekmore of Toledo. Barbara Lewis trains with a two-year-old bust at Northfield Park. 202, earnings of $19,000. Coming in from Raceway Park, Russell Swartz driving Gin Queen. The four is a Shimitar filly, owned by Wilbur Stolang of Jamestown, Ohio. Frank Todd Jr. trains. Three year record at Hoosier Park, two minutes and one, earnings of fourteen thousand dollars coming in from Raceway Park. Frank Todd Jr. driving six points. The five is an Arnie's Exchange filly on the Monica Wolf of Milan, Michigan, David Wolf, the uh, trainer, with a three year old record at Raceway Park, two minutes and three, earnings of twenty eight thousand dollars off a winning qualifier, Jeff Fout driving Arnie's message. The six is a Lucky Elmerhurst filly on by Billy Mitchell of Lexington, Kentucky. He also trains with a mark at Lexington, two minutes and three, eleven thousand dollars in earnings. Mike Zoller driving lucky, nevertheless. And of the seven as they carry the message, Philly owned by Harold Breidenbaugh of Lana. Harold Dick, the trainer, a mark of two one and one. Her last start in an Ohio Sires at Raceway Park, earnings of sixty two thousand dollars. Harold Dick driving at a two dance. There's your field for the first division of Ohio Sires win play show perfecta and a trifecta wagering. Seven minutes now remain until post time. Seven minutes. Three of the Philly Trotters and Ohio Sires lining up moving in. On the back stretch, approaching the start. And uh, they're off, and from the outside, it's Arnie's message. First for the lead attitude dance from the outside, getting away second. Towards the inside, Lizzie Brown and six point is right there. Off the pylons and racing a fifth came Kerry of the Lady. Then it's a gap of three lengths, six on the inside to Gin Queen, the uh, trailer. Lucky, nevertheless, around the first turn in Arnie's message. On the frontier, six point. Now to the outside as they're pressuring the leader. Lizzie Brown at the rail trots third as they reach the first quarter, 27 and three. Moving right along here and on the outside, a six point takes the lead. Arnie's message on the inside gives it up for cover. That leaves Ada to dance uncovered, and she's moving first up on the outside, and she's pressuring third. Lizzie Brown has found a seat. She remains fourth on the inside. Carry the Lady is fifth. Gin Queen is out and moving, uh, racing a sixth. Lucky, nevertheless, lagging behind a bit here, trotting seventh. They approach the half, and six point calling the shots now. Ada to dance on the outside at the leader's wheel, half in 58 seconds. Moving to the back stretch and six point, wanting a breather here. Out of the outside, added to dance. Uncovered the entire mile. At the rail, trotting a three, Arnie's message to the outside. Perfect trip now for Lizzie Brown as she picks up cover. Gin Queen selects a three wide move here as they swing out wide as they race down the back side. And on the front, six point as a game leader, but added to dance is right there looking to wear her down at the three quarters and 128. And off stride now goes Arnie's message, and Arnie's message jumps it off here, goes in a break, drops down to the passing lane, and uh, moving through quickly now to the outside comes Curry the Lady. On the way home now with less than an eighth of a mile ago, and six point has put away Attitude Dance, but she's had a rough trip here. Curry the Lady, a 35 to 1 shot, longest shot of the board, comes to the outside, she closes with every stride, but six point hangs on here, six point by four. Carry the ladies second, up for third, and a two dance. Ladies and gentlemen, trackside, the official winner, the first division, fourth leg of Ohio Sires, number four, six point. Chestnut, daughter of Shimachar, from the final score, Mary Yunus score. And she's a homebred. Owned by Wilbur Stolang of Jamestown, Ohio, Frank Todd Jr., the uh, trainer driver. Six point enjoying a successful rookie season thus far. 
in eight career starts now. She has three wins under her belt, two consecutive Ohio Sires wins, and a career mark to go with it, 158 and a two fifth. Trackside to make that trophy presentation is the secretary of the Ohio Standard Bread Development Fund, Mr. Charlie Bowen. The order of finish, the one carry, the lady two, Lizzie Brown six, Jin Queen five, six point, the winner, Arnie's message seven, Lucky nevertheless four, added two dance three, rechecking two six five one seven four and a three.